Okay guys, in this video we will do Island of the Damned walkthrough 100% clear. So I'm just gonna show you what I'm using now. I'm gonna use Hankfire, All Seeing Eye, Vulture. From the spells I have Stigma Diabolicum for getting the additional weak spot on the enemies, especially on the boss. And Concupia to get unlimited ammo for 16 seconds, right? Improved healing stability and reload. And from these three I'm using Relic the Book of Serpents to deal the DK if enemies touches me or whatever, they can die instantly. And I'm using Ring for DK also, so when you dash you leave these bombs that apply DK curse and fetish to resurrect me one time from death. And all three, I, I mostly use these three. For me it's the best these three, right? And I'm on Gnosis 4, level 75. So let's just go and do the Island of the Dam, guys. So now the island is the first map, is the easiest one. You will play the Island of the Damned a lot before you move to the others. So let's just go and do it. So I'm gonna use these guns now to show you how this works also. And So with this gun you just wanna crit because then this gun you see what it's doing. Critical tri triggers radial shockwave and if the critical hit dealt increased damage it also applies DK. You just want to headshot enemies with more than 75% of the HP and this gun is lodging bullets and then into... The more enemies you lodge bullets in, the more damage you will deal, of course, so... Let's see now. So if you dodge, they will just start to get DK, guys, and... Oh, buddy! Didn't see this one, but we are good. So now my Arcana, guys, I have Stamina here, then Nimble Fingers for Firearms, then Health, then Light Spell, and again the weapons. So now here I'm gonna use... I'm gonna take Rejuvenation. That's for 20% faster regeneration speed. Buddy, what the fuck are you doing, man? Okay, guys. I'm missing a lot now with this gun, guys, but let's use this one a bit. So I just wanna do headshots like this and... Buddy! Where are you guys? So now you see, no matter where he are, where he is. The gun, when you reload, is gonna deal damage as you shoot, and this guy will die from DK. Come on, buddy, just die, bitch. One more enemy is here. Tip from this area. So what we got now? Oh, yeah, so this is the best from the Nimble Fingers, guys. You wanna take this, because you see now, stability handling and ADS plus 40%. That's almost half more so what we got here it's chest Let's see. only two golden feathers right so we're gonna go and make a full circle guys then go with the dungeon scent that's gonna be it from this island so you will play this island a lot until you move to the harder maps yeah, let's use this gun now a bit again Oh my god, all of these. Let's see. Guys, what are you doing, bitch? So now you see with this gun.
With this gun and with this ring, guys, it's easy to play this first map. Where are you, man? Don't run, man. Okay. And we clear this also. I will try to get to the dungeons with all five potions because you need them for the last boss, guys. It has a few phases, so... Health sacrifice, so the last elixir. Health sacrifice, so now maximum health is minus 30%, but weapon damage plus 20%. Let's grab all this and... Yeah, let's do all this now. So the island is fairly easy once you know what you're doing, but uh, these spells, I forgot to use them, guys. <laughs> A lot of time I forgot on the fucking spells, right? Let's see now who we have here. This is the bullets, but I'm not gonna take them yet. First, clear all these guys here. Come on, Vizy. Okay, one headshot, but he, because he's too far, then you don't deal the full damage, right? Guys. Let's see what we got here now. And extra light spell full of magic. Light spell recharge. I will take this because now I have extra one extra charge. You can do a light spell twice in a row. And yeah, let's go. Clear the top. Here, come on buddy. Let's use this pistol a bit again. To launch the bullets. Okay, I need stamina. Come on, buddy. You are still alive. Come on, man, this guy. Yeah. Now the next one. Reload slide, reload dash. Mm. Then I will do reload dash. Weapon damage plus 10% after the reload. After the dash, I mean, sorry. So now... What is left, actually? Just the down, okay, let's do that. And we're gonna visit the dungeons then. So you can always go wherever you want, guys. Just jump before you drop down again and... You will not hurt yourself. Okay, health elixir here. Where is the dungeon? I need to remember that. Because I still have five, I'm not gonna use it now. And let's clear all this now with this gun. Buddy! Come on, where is everybody else? Here. Okay, guys. Don't hide and run, don't. Okay, now let's do a pistol a bit. Why not? So it's easy to dodge these spells from these guys. Another chest. Don't like this one. Buddy, where are you fucking going? Man? Look at this guy. Bye, buddy. A little bit of Angelica, another chest. Oh yeah, that's what I like. Eight gold, guys. So what we got here now? Live wire and the bonus elixir, but I will take the live wire. Because it's strongly reduced weight before stamina begins regenerating. So if I now run... If I now run and use the stamina, look at these guys. It's gonna start regenerating really quickly, but... 
Yeah, they are all the way on the other side. Let's use this a bit again. So I want to just watch the dots on the map, guys, and that's it. If you don't do headshots with this gun, it's actually a terrible gun, guys. You need lots of bullets to kill the enemy. The last arcana. Blind fire, non-critical weapon damage or the pendulum, I will take this. So it's, if it's not the crits now, it's gonna deal 25% more damage, right? Here is another chest and that's the bullets, okay, let's take the bullets now. That's it from this, I'm gonna start doing dungeons now. So first the small one. You don't need to stop to collect the resources, you can just press E, continue to run. It will grab them also, and now here is the health. But again, I don't need it yet, guys, because I still have five. Little bit of Angelica here. Now let's clear this dungeon, because here you will get 14 gold in the end. So you wanna clear this dungeon for gold. But you need to do it in this time, in this six minutes, guys, so now just... Now you see, if you don't do headshots, these guys are just not dying. But if you do them like this, then it's all good. Now I will change to pistol a bit. Sorry, buddy. Pistol, oh, oops, I almost dropped down. I don't want to do that because you will die, of course. Now another guy is there. Now three guys are there. Now you see, I didn't use the fucking spells at all yet, so... Now I need to move a little bit back, use this. Buddy! Okay, he touched me, but... Just burning now a little bit, doesn't matter. Now that guy there. <laughs> Look at this guy now, guys. Buddy, sorry, but you are dead, man. So with this gun, it's easy to clear things like this. Now back to pistol. These two guys here now. Okay, now here, I usually use just one arrow because if you get it good, like this, they will all die now, guys. So now they are, they are all dead except that guy. Sorry, man. <laughs> you will not jump anywhere. Now with this, just gonna shoot that guy first, go back here. Now, watch a few bullets there. They will also die. Same goes with these guys. Now double jump here, double jump again. And double jump again, guys. Now two guys are here. Sorry guys. Then two are on top of there. He hit me once, but okay. Come on, where are you hiding? Which? Now I'm gonna use one health. Take this, let's go. I'm gonna jump here again, of course. But this is where I died the last time because I I dropped down here, guys. <laughs> I dropped when I when I was jumping. You know what I mean? Fucking stupid. So now let me just check what I have. Yeah, concupia and stigma diabolicum. Let's use this now, guys. Look at this now. Because now I can lodge much more bullets. 
to je last one reel. Reload always, you know what I mean? It's gonna be infinite bullets for 16 seconds. So who is left? Two more guys. And one is on top here. And after you clear this in time, guys, here is always gonna be these two chests. Each one with seven gold, right? So 14 gold from this dungeon. Then you just want to exit here, back from where you started. And that's it, this dungeon cleared. Now we're gonna go to the Wailing Tower, which is main dungeon. Try to clear and kill the boss there. And now I take this health here, of course, back to five. And let's go to the tower, guys. Now in the tower, I can actually do whatever I want, all the way up to third level. Then it's gonna be a little bit trickier, but again, once you know what you're doing, it's not hard, you know what I mean. Here we are in the Wailing Tower now, guys. So let's just start and doing it. Each level is a bit harder than the previous one. So first, I'm not gonna kill anybody here, guys. I'm just doing the run. So I wanna jump here, then down there. Then just start killing these guys. Because here is easy now. Come on, guys. Just stay here, lodge the bullets, or you can change to this gun. Do a few patches. Very easy, you just need to stay here and just shoot them like this, no matter what gun you are using, guys. Oh fuck, now I didn't want to do this, but okay. I used one bullet from the... Now we need to take this to be able to progress down. Uh, to healing, health, health, oh my god. I need to take the stationary scope, so now if I'm aiming like this, I can't move, guys. You know what I mean? <laughs> Let's take all this, because in the end, this essence, you can only use it after you kill the boss here, to make a prophecy, guys. And you can make five prophecies, so you need to kill this boss five times, to be able to make five prophecies, right? So now I'm not gonna take bullets or anything else, because the second level here, what I usually do is this. Because here you need to kill enemies from this circle, so just... Come on, buddy, what the fuck is going on? And then the first circle done, guys. Then what you wanna do... Immediately, immediately go to the next one. And start killing from here, because... Again, you want to clear this as quick as possible, so... We don't want any unnecessary... ...losing of health. Oh my god, guys! So you want to just kill them from the circle, down the second one is done. Again, just go quickly to the third one. And now we need to just kill everybody from the last circle here. To be able to progress to the last area. So 
Okay, don't have any more bullets for the gun. Maybe now I fucked it up a bit, I need to use this. And I don't know, for me the game lags when I'm on this final circle, right? And once you do this, the uh, rest of the enemies will just disappear. And now I'm gonna grab everything that is here. Need to take the bullets now for the next level, guys, so I need to take two. Need to take this one and... So, dual primary, okay, 25% less damage. Need to take the bullets also. So now, no retreat, okay, now I can't go back, right? It's going very slowly, but it does matter. Let's just grab everything, what is left now here. Need these echoes to raise the level. Okay, lots of echoes, because now the enemies are dropping echoes. Because I have that quest, you see in the top left corner. And let's progress to the final level. Just reload everything. Because now here, what we actually need to do, guys, is... I'm mean, gonna use one of these. Oh no, yeah, but with the gun now. Because now I can watch bullets how much I want. You want to kill this first priest, this priest is as quick as possible to be able to open this door and you wanna go immediately here. Because here you don't need to kill anybody guys, you just wanna run, ar uh, run away from these guys. And you want this dream to end, so these 20 seconds, you want that to finish as quick as possible, right? So you don't need to kill these guys, waste bullets and shit. Because all we need to do is just kill the priests, right? So not these guys. But the priests, and now when the dream ends, I'm gonna be back here. And now just kill the priests again, guys. So not, not these other guys, but. But okay, I can also kill them, I don't. I mean, why not? Come on, buddy, what are you doing? So we want just the priest. Because once you kill the priests, this shit will open again. And then we need to go there again, right? So And once we are back, it's gonna just finish everything. So where is the last... Come on, guys. This is the last fucking... Oh, one more. So after this, this will unlock... What the fuck? Where are you hiding, bitch? It's down there, oh my god. And now this is opened again. You wanna rush quickly, so another 20 seconds. So just run again here. You don't need to do anything, guys. You don't need to kill anybody here. You just want these seconds to go. Right? I always do this, I just run away. And now once you are back, it's done, you know what I mean? Because we need to just kill the priests, nothing else. Now take this. Dual witchcraft, dual primary, okay. Now here you can take 20 essence, but then the enemies will spawn again. The same was at the previous level, but I just didn't show you. But now I will take them because I'm going on the final boss. Now you see the new enemies will spawn again here, right? So you don't want to stay here anymore. You want to go now and kill the final boss, so... We have three potions. Let me check the weapons. It's all good. We will start with this. Now this guy comes and phases, guys. You want to start with this. Oh my god, I missed so many times. So now here you can heal yourself, take bullets again, you know what I mean. It's not that... Uh, it's not that you don't have health or the bullets or whatever. Come on, buddy, where are you now? What the fuck is this? Okay, you are hiding, right? Oh, 
I don't want this to... And now once you hit him a lot, he's gonna spawn this, guys. So now these guys... Come on, buddy. Because we want to lodge bullets. Definitely. Oh my god, I need to use this, guys, because... I don't want to die here. Okay, I was a little bit stupid now here, but I don't have any more bullets. Come on, buddy, where are you? Oh yeah, now these guys also... It's shit because... I see how this gun is actually not for this. Oh my god, I know what I didn't do. <laughs> okay, let's... Let's take this. Use what last health. No. And now this phase, we just want to do this, guys. That's why I took this. For more damage, right? And now the new phase again, this shit. One more time. Last priest, come on, man. So we need to do this phase just one more time. But now lots of these guys. So I need to use the pistol. And... Uh, here is the heal, I didn't use my... Uh, I didn't use the... The relic yet, so it's all good. Because we need to kill everybody for the boss to appear again. That's the only thing, and now... This phase, guys. Be okay, come on, man. Just, just die, man. And immediately my, <laughs> my thing saved me, right? So that's it from this, guys. I lo I used all bullets also from the pistol, and in the end, it actually saved me. My fetish, right? The mandrake healed me fully. And we are out from the dungeon. And now what you can do with all these guys here. We can make prophecies, right? But let me see, what is this? Heal yourself, I don't need. Is there anything else to pick up here? It's not. But once you kill the boss, guys, you can come here and then... For 70 Divine Essence, manifest prophecy. And I got the pro prophet of the bull. Now I can't see it here, because I need to go back to base. And that's it from this Wailing Tower dungeon, guys. So I passed it with Hankfire and the All-Seeing Guy, Stigma Diabolicon and Corcupia, and I was actually... I didn't use this almost <laughs> never. Same with this. So if you like this video, guys, consider liking, subscribing, and commenting, and join me in another Witchfire video where we're gonna do something else. Until then, bye, guys. And so now you see my stats here. I didn't do events. 217 kills. And all this.